recovery relief modeling is a process of using three different tools within ArtCam. These tools are the Relief Cookie Cutter, the Transform tool, and the Relief Clip Art Library. Traditionally in ArtCam, when a relief was created, it was locked in that position and could not be moved. The Cookie Cutter allows you to basically free up the relief and places you directly in the Transform tool ready for making adjustments. Here you can see that I have a fleur de lis relief that I would like to make smaller and create some sort of pattern with it. It can be turned into floating clip art, which is always blue by selecting the relief cookie cutter, which is located here. It can then be resized as you would any other entity. If you select inside the banding box, you can move the part Selecting the outside allows you to rotate. I want to move the blue rotation anchor point to the bottom of the relief so that I can rotate around it. If I select control on the keyboard, it will create a copy. If I also hold down alt, it will give me an angle snap. I can also see in real time how these reliefs will interact with each other before pasting down. I'm keeping a 90 degree angle snap on this whilst moving by holding down Alt on the keyboard. The red arrow on the clip art allows for real time Z height adjustment. You can also enter a height for Z in the dialog box. Make sure that you have the correct combine mode selected prior to pasting the reliefs down by toggling the icon at the bottom of the dialog. The default is set to merge high, but here I have changed it to add, and it's not the correct combine mode for these pieces. If you want to change this, just select the undo icon and it will go back to floating clip art. You just need to select the clip art and then select transform, or use the shortcut T on the keyboard. To paste the clip art down, either select paste in the dialog or press enter on the keyboard. You can free this up again at any time by using the relief cookie cutter and again create copies if you wish to do so. Not only can the relief cookie cutter free up a whole relief, it can also free up an area within a selected vector. Just select the vector to act as a boundary and then select the relief cookie cutter. This will turn any relief within the vector into floating clip art, which can then be modified. Here I am creating a mirrored copy and adjusting the heights to give this fairy a set of wings. Note that I have pasted them to a new layer so that the wings and the fairy body are on separate layers.